Good morning. So we've just left our campsite at Sandy Cape. Sorry, I'm going to brush my hair, but it's a little unsightly today. And we've taken this four wheel track, which I'll show you. Um, we're going to try and find some old World War II bunkers. But it's quite narrow. This is our first four wheel drive experience. Oh, yay, yay. Um, we did speak to the ranger before we came down here, so he said we should be all right for most of it, but if the sand gets soft, drop our tyres, and if we see any sand dunes, don't drive up them because the wind's blowing the sand out. Uh, we don't want to go up a hill and not, ooh, blimey, and up here to get back down. <sighs> pretty cool. I would open the windows, but it keeps hitting the trees. <laughs> <laughs> we gave up trying to drive the car up here, even though we have a four wheel drive. And we're just walking now to see if we can find them. But to be honest, they're not showing on our maps. And so we're not sure where they are. It's a beautiful view. <laughs> so, so are they over there? I don't know. I'm going for, I'm going hunting all over that place. Well, there's the soft sand he was talking about. Yeah, but how was we supposed to get Look at the car view, down there? That's what he meant when it was a washout, don't go down there. Ah, we found it. <laughs> we found the sign for it. Is it? No, this is a nature reserve. Oh, oh man. No access. Keep off the island. Oh, that's for the island. Okay, well, we did, haven't found the bunkers yet, but we've got down to the, the sea. Where the heck are they? I don't know. There's another side all the way up there. <laughs> And that island is a reserve for the sea lions. No one's allowed on there. Not that I'm going to swim over there today, anyhow. Oh, very pretty. I haven't found the bunkers. River Road's going to be a trip, isn't it? <laughs> so we've arrived in Geraldton and we're just up at the seafront. Oh, it's very lovely here, actually. Um, and it's warmer, <laughs> finally. It's not so windy. And people are swimming. That's a, that's a good sign. Anyway, let me just show you the seafront. So this, this is great, isn't it? They've got the barbecue areas here where you can cook. This is what I like about Australia. It's so geared up for outdoor life. Got a little cafe up there, the beach. What a lovely beach. And then you've got, it's quite industrial over there, isn't it? And I did, yeah, it's lovely here. So this is Geraldton, Geraldton, Geraldton. Keep saying it wrong. 
There's the library over there, and we did drive in through the town, and it was a pretty little town. Anyway, we're going to we'll sit in here, having our salad. I'll get the shaded side. Great. <laughs> and we'll just have our salad in front of the beach. Nice. Salad homemade. Oh, God, just make a homemade salad. No, no, it's not nonsense. Look at these cool little things. Oh, God, he's moaning. Look at the pretty patterns. Always over there moaning because I'm looking at things. <coughs> Honestly. It's not Tut, they're made for the Aboriginals, ancestors. They're very pretty, all different designs. And then we have a monument here. With blue, get out of the way. That's an old building, isn't it, on the corner? Old buildings. Oh yeah. That's some old buildings. So this is the This is the main street of Geraldton and the Freemasons Hotel. What a beautiful building. It's like a seasidey town. It's got lots of art shops, surf shop. shops. Oh, we could have had a band me. that say blue the best office look at the art on the wall and on the, uh, the box there I love the colors on the street There's a camping shop there, Blue, if you want to look for your frying pan. It's probably going to be cheaper in the... Dress. Um, you might get a frying pan in there and the two buck shop.
Why are you taking photos of fucking rocks? What are you doing? You wait till you wait. You wait. You're going to see. When you're, oh, I need the toilet. I need to do this. I'm going to oh, okay, do, 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 do. I think they would have a toilet down the fucking You did say you needed the toilet. I needed a toilet for about half an hour. You didn't tell me that, did you? Otherwise. <laughs> Every what? time I want to go for a coffee, you walk past the fucking coffee shop. Oh, there's one up here. I thought you wanted to go by the beach, that's why. No, there's one up top of here. Yeah. Yellow thing. Yeah, so you said you wanted to no, go for a cappuccino. Oh, they're fishing over there, Blue. Look. So we're fishing up there. Are they fishing on the end? So I think we'll just throw the line in. Here? Yeah? Or oh, the one up there? No, the one up there. Maybe it's good, that's why. Just up to this cute little cafe here to grab a cappuccino for my brother and a milkshake for me. Just overlooking the sea. Gentle. Mm. Oh, that's refreshing. So we've left Geraldton and we are making our way to Coronation Beach um, at our last campsite. A lady recommended this campsite to us, said it was quite similar but closer to the beach. Is that right, Blue? Yeah. Yep. yep. And so we're going to go and check that out. And the sun is out and hopefully stays out so we can enjoy <laughs> heating outside last night. Oh my God, it was so windy and cold. We had to cook inside and I was hiding in my duvet and then we, we just didn't go outside. It was terrible. But hopefully tonight we can enjoy a nice meal outside on our camp chairs. It's very pretty around here. Right, but you know when we're at the campsite. Gosh, look at that. How beautiful is that? So not as good as Half Moon Bay. You haven't got down there yet. You'll change your mind. It's exactly like that. But the drive down is, isn't it? Look at it. And we can't camp at Half Moon Bay. What? We can't camp at Half Moon Bay. Because you would if you could. Oh, what's mark. that? Is that a normal cat or a yeah, feral? That's a Kitty cat. cat. <laughs> Pooty cat. What's he doing out here in the middle of nowhere? Well, I don't know, maybe he's a caretaker or something. It's a viewing day. I 
320 yards, turn left. Oh. That's it. Oh, this is the right one? Yeah, that's it. Oh, we have to stop at the reception. Then arrive at your destination. Do we have to book? Daddy. I'm just but... looking. Self-contained campus? Oh, no. What? Day use, camping area, please respect others, enjoy walking speed. Oh, that's odd because there's, there's a beach one here. Uh -huh. Please pay fees prior to setting up camp. No free road camp area only. Should we find out where the fucking, where we pay? Oh my God. In 280 yards, oh, no. arrive at Coronation Beach Campground. There's your camping fees there. Oh, there, look, we have to pay here. Yeah, is that here? <laughs> yeah. I think that's here, so, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah, so go, you're going to have to sort that out. Ask me if there's a space, right? So. Oh, good evening. So we've arrived at our campsite, and uh, this is a view behind me. Look at it, it's quite beautiful. Look at that, isn't that nice? And our camp is just there, behind the white van. That's us. Well, we were a little bit faster today setting up the, the camper, but my brother's in there swearing at the moment because he can't get around to do his cooking. Anyhow, I went to the toilets, they weren't very pleasant. So I've set up the shower tent and put the board to potty in it. I'm like, oh, I'm not going back in there. I've never seen so many cobwebs in my life. Ooh. No, I'm not scared of most things, but cobweb, uh, spiders is not my thing. Anyway, when he's finished messing around in that van, we'll go for a walk down the beach. But isn't it stunning? What a view. And the sun is out. Makes all the difference. There's a close-up of our van. It's so like I said, to put the shower tent out. And it's got the porta potty in there. Now I'm sure, which is not great, is it? Because it's blown out of the tent. And I'm pretty sure they're supposed to give you ground pegs for it, but they haven't done that. So it's going to be interesting showering in there. Uh, we brought this mat today because they gave us this stupid little mat that did nothing. And we just kept getting out he comes. It's a mission, isn't it? Getting in and out. Oh, but that's we're on the camera. No. That's and shit. Yeah. Where are you going? I'm going to sit out here and have a fucking beer. I thought we were going for a walk. Well, I'm going for a walk after I've had the beer. Oh, God. And this is the van. So. We have like a little kitchenette area. And this is all the cupboards we have because my brother's bed is here. So we can't use the cupboard underneath there. And that's my bed and it's terribly messy. We have to just throw everything up there. And then when we leave in the morning, we throw it all onto Blue's bed so that we can shut the camp and get moving. But this is home for two months. Wee. Right, I want to go to the beach. We should that's, not like, that's not the issue. The issue is there's no space for nothing. And when I'm trying to cook a meal, you can't do fucking all. <laughs> it is very small in here. Very small. Oh, vegetable, steak, four chops. I've made salads for tomorrow. And the sink, Jesus Christ. I've had turds bigger than that sink. <laughs> Honestly, just ignore him. There is a problem with the sink though because uh, it oh, leaks. It's got a leak as well. So everything that we had in the cupboards underneath it are wet. <sighs> oh well, the joys of camping. <laughs> and here's the beach. How come the waves come sideways?
That's proper shallow, isn't it? It's lovely though, isn't it? Oh, this is nice. See, this is the bush in the back. Not stood in a van trying to make a bloody dinner. Oh, jeez, Louise. Oh, very shallow. It's not bad in this bit. Can you? So after that lovely long walk on the beach, I had a shower in the shower tent. It wasn't that bad actually, but of course, because I'm in public, I had to take all my clothes in there to get changed into, and my feet got very muddy in there, and I had to wash them separately. Uh, we only have cold water on this camper van, so, but I did bring my, um, my pump from my camper van at home, so I filled a bucket with a kettle full of boiling water and some cold and had a warm shower. But oh, it was nice just to wash my hair. Now we've had dinner outside, it was very pleasant this evening and now I'm in the camper van on my bed watching YouTube. And I will see you tomorrow. So tomorrow we're off to Kalbari National Park. Um, only about a couple of hours drive from here. So that'll be fun. I quite like this campsite. I don't like the toilets or the shower room they have here, but otherwise it's very nice on the beach. Catch up with you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye.